Welcome to Walsall Classic Sports Car. Uh, today we're delighted to offer to you uh, this Jaguar Mark II. It's a 3.4 manual with overdrive with power steering. Um, it's a vehicle we sold previously, it's of the highest quality from an older restoration carried out from 1991 to 1993 with bills enclosed just the then for over £27,000. The car's had much expenditure since then, but the quality of the restoration has held up very well, as you'll see as we walk you around the car. The paintwork is absolutely glorious for this age of the restoration. It's held up very, very well. A few little marks on it here and there, we should expect, but it's a perfectly usable car. Underneath it, there is no corrosion, it was properly sealed and everything at the time and also you can tell on these Mark II's the quality of the restoration just by these door gaps. Well the chrome work is very good, there are a couple of little small marks just on probably the door handles but it certainly doesn't want me doing. All the quarter lights are all working, everything, window frames and everything are beautiful and the panel fit it's superb. It's fitted with the driver's lights. Again, paintwork. It's just as good as when we sold it a few years ago. Good number plates. And as you look down the car, you'll see the super panel fit. A few marks on the cars are stamped in there, just uh, started to just go a little bit, but very, very little anywhere on the car. Perfect driver quality car. It's fitted on these uh, chrome wire wheels. You can see the disc brakes at the back there through the wheels, looking down the cells, again no corrosion or anything anywhere. As you come to the front wheels, you can see the disc brakes through there but you will also notice the addition of these Coopercraft This vehicle's got the wheel arch spans in there, you can see. The lights, bumpers are perfect chrome. Again, panel fit is lovely. Roof and glass all in good condition. This vehicle's got each of your window and it's a 3.4 manual of overdrive and power steering. Inside the car, you see this grey leather upholstery which is in a beautiful patinaed condition. The woodwork has all been reveneered in the 90s and it's perfect today. It has got a modern radio there, manual gearbox, all the switches and dials are nice, but if you look around the wood, I hope it's not too dark for you, and the headlining, all in lovely condition. Central armrest in the back, you'll see the addition of rear seat belts, not matching the front uh, Jaguar items, but they are there if you want to take family out in the car. Got a three spoke motor litre steering wheel, and then you'll see the overdrive there. It's showing 27,700 miles, so the MOT is going back to 1986. Um, it's not been a while since then. Again, if you look down the door pillars, their quality is superb. The carpets, they've got blue carpets in superb condition in front and rear, very nicely fitted door cards and all the chrome work is all very good all around 
and going into the back just the same story just a lovely lovely old car picnic trays again carpets it's got fire extinguisher fitted in the rear there Got the pillars in the boot there's a tool kit and a hammer and also underneath the rear they've got another chrome wire wheel some spares and another hammer for some reason and also a boot and tiger there with some more parts in there Uh, under the bonnet in a second. Very good car on the road, it drives lovely, it works in fourth gear as it should do. Uh, there are just a few drops of oil from the back of the engine, most likely the rear main oil seal, but we would not be doing that not that bad. You go inside with the doors there and underneath the bottom of the doors as you can see no corrosion anywhere. Okay. Under the bonnet straight six 3.4 litre twin SU carbs. It's got a newly reconditioned set of SU carbs there. Uh, the choke is an electronic one it's a manual choke. That's got a, the addition of a Kenlo electronic fan which is mounted just behind the front radiator grille if you can see it. You have also got the uh, original fan on there as well and also it's got an alternator. Looking down on the inside of the inner wings there. Nice and shiny. Threw a little bit of flaky paint lower down. Eater box all in nice condition. Bulkheads all shiny paintwork. Battery there you'll see it's got a cut off switch on the earth side there. Again just nice not over detailed through dents on top of the radiator there. Nice and shiny on the rocker covers there. Green cylinder head and also under the bonnet it's nice shiny paintwork not under sealed. So there we are, 1967 Jaguar Mark II 3.4 manual of overdrive ready to be enjoyed by its next owner. Okay we'll just take you for a puzzle of the road in this lovely Mark II Jaguar. 3.40 manual of overdrive See it's pulling through the curves, very, very smooth, steering is dead straight ahead. Now in fourth gear. Coming down the gears, no crunches. So there we are, what's not to like about this car? It's 
but if you are interested, please give us a call on 01507 606 725 or look, view this video and all the photos on our website, walsideclassics.co.uk. Thanks again.